got something interesting that was taught to me a long time ago, which, yeah, sometimes I forget about, sometimes I don't, but I thought I'd share it with you guys. Um, things like angle grinders, um, chop saws, skill saws, they usually come with a two-pin plug, um, something similar to this. Obviously, in different countries, you'll have different plugs, but they're all similar style, two pins sticking straight out. Um, why? Well, today was a prime example of why. I was obviously using the angle grinder when it bit and kicked. Um, half the disc is, well, part of the disc is still in the job that I was busy cutting up. Well, what happened was as it kicked, the whole angle grinder twisted in my hand. And obviously now I don't know in the instant how I'm holding this thing and if it's going to start cutting my hand apart or my arm or something else. So initial reaction was throw the angle grinder um, because it's got a on off switch, not a momentary switch. Um, big job, big cut. I'm, I've got it in the on position. So if I throw it, it's still going to keep running. Um, as a, this is where the reason for the plug comes in. So as soon as I threw the angle grinder, run, rush, move straight over to the plug point and you grab the cable and you just pull. And then the plug comes out. If you had a three pin plug or some other fancy plug, you would not be able to do this. It would take you a few seconds to grab the plug, grab the, yeah, grab it properly and disconnect the two halves. With this, you just give it a rip and it comes out and the power tool shuts off. And that's the reason for the two pin plug and not a three pin with earth. I hope it helps someone. Definitely helped me today.